Nice hat, buddy. What is going on, guys? Um, it is Sunday. We decided to come back out to the Huddleston Pond. We had some great success yesterday, uh, Mr. Smith and I, and we thought we'd come by and try it again today. I won't be able to go fishing. I'll be heading out to Utah, so we thought we'd get out here, uh, do a little vlog, and get some some dope content for you guys. So let's see if we can't catch any trout here, guys. See, every time I walk up, it seems like you're you're getting onto a fish. What's going on here, guy? Am I your good luck charm? <laughs> I don't know. There it is. So it looks like they're out here, guys. So I'm going to get rigged up and catch some fish. All right, guys. So if you guys want to know what uh, Mr. Smith and I are slaying them on, a couple of uh, garlic-scented eggs here. Get two of them on there. And use a treble, size 16. And on the last one, you kind of want to whack this one through the nose. Just a little pink gulp grub. It looks like uh, it looks like a set of cash and prizes. Yeah, that works. They like cash and prizes, I guess. All right, guys, let's get out there enough talk before Mr. Smith catches all the dang fish. That might be good right there. Tighten it up. You got another one? Nice. One of these days, guys, I'll be like Mr. Smith. Oh, there goes my line. There you go. Oh, there's one. Here we go. Oh, I think he came off. Oh, no, he's still on. There's one. All right, first fish of the day, guys. Hey, hey, take it easy, guy. First fish of the day. Your hands wet a little bit. Oh, you tossed my grub, you little son of a gun. Stop flopping. I'll get it out of there. And there he goes. Dang it, man, I want that grub back. I know, right? Those are expensive. <laughs> kind of. When you add it all up, yeah, they are. Here, I'm just going to try one of the grubs. Just an egg and a grub and see what happens with that. So these are the ticket, guys. Garlic scented. Little eggs here. And some gulp grubs. Dude, it is a setup. I'm not gonna let him in on all the secrets. Just, just the bait. Yep. Oh, you son of a gun, man. Yep. Hitting it. Take it. There we go. Hold still. I'll unhook ya. I think I'm just gonna try to get one more, guys. One more for the books. It's a little cold, man. Oh, here we go. Here's a bite. Come on. Take it. No. Get it back out there real quick. Hopefully, hopefully it's still there. It's right in front of the tree for some reason. We're going to be going to Utah uh, for my brother-in-law's wedding, and uh, I don't think I'll be able to do any fishing out there, and just uh, how busy we are, so I figured why not come out here. 
do a little bit of fishing for you hey guys there we go and there's the one last one for the day here oh no 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 here we go okay guys here it is last fish hooked him hooked him decently so he's gonna live and actually there's my little trout magnet thing and there he goes okay guys so here's our first stop we are at Pendleton uh, we are at the Arrowhead Travel Plaza is what it's called I guess I'm just looking over at it uh, we always buy knives here he always buys knives here and he always buys knives here so this is our first stop we're just getting some snacks getting Jacob some milk and we're gonna get back on the road we got so much longer to go but let's see you guys inside they always have a bunch of crazy stuff like they have samurai swords Austin's gonna buy a samurai sword Austin you're gonna buy a samurai sword I want to buy a samurai sword he's gonna buy a samurai sword it's like like they have throwing stars why why what do you need throwing stars for you can't steal stuff why are you stealing things? Check your pocket. Let me check your pockets, sir. Sir, empty your pockets. So, I did forget my fishing pole. Or I didn't bring a fishing pole. I think that's the perfect setup to catch sharks. Um, if you guys are ever going to go shark fishing, this is what you need to come and get. Right there. You got your little worms and a bobber, and that's all you need. Okay, we should get Jacob this. Look. Wait, wait, hold on. Nice hat, buddy. Alright guys, so we're back on the road. I probably won't film any more of the traveling. We still have five hours to go. Five, uh, six hours to go. 412 miles. So, that's a lot of pointless filming. I'm just going to do some editing, do some studying. And we'll see you guys when we get there. We're going to be doing some pretty cool stuff. So stay tuned. What is going on, guys? So I didn't do much filming of the rest of the trip. I was dead exhausted. We had been up since like five in the morning. Uh, so I just didn't feel like doing any filming. Uh, it's super windy outside right now. I don't know if you guys could see this tree here, but it's so dang windy. But we are still gonna be doing something super fun. We're gonna play some archery tag and I am gonna strap the GoPro on, probably to my forehead so we can get a good view. Um, and we'll see you guys there. It's going to be a ton of fun. So I hope you guys enjoy this footage of the archery tag. We'll see you guys in there. Dad, get back here. David! David! It's like a Bigfoot saw in here. Anthony! Anthony! Dang it! How's it going? <laughs> It's going. Hey, hey Anthony, how does it feel to lose? It feels like so a headshot. It feels so good. I'm so happy you shot me in the face, Lee. <laughs> 
All right, guys, so as I'm editing this video, I realize that I don't have a proper outro. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed me getting shot and me shooting Anthony in the face to win the game and the trout fishing and all of that. If you guys like these, let me know. Drop a like. Leave it in the comment section below. I'll do more, a lot more vlogs. So stay tuned, guys, for the next episode of Spartan Kid Outdoors. Welcome aboard uh, Spartan Airlines. This is your captain speaking. Uh...